Hi, I'm Dave Epstein. Welcome to Growing Wisdom. Today we're talking cucumber disease. I am in my garden and I've got lots of cucumbers going. As a matter of fact, we have a beautiful little cucumber just starting right there. But what I want to talk to you about today is this particular plant, which as you can see is not doing very well. Very quickly this is dying and it is a symptom of bacterial wilt. It's a wilt that is spread by the cucumber beetle. So the cucumber beetle is a small striped beetle. That beetle basically acts as a vector for the bacterial wilt. It chews on the leaves here and then it spreads the disease to the plant. Check the variety you're growing. Some varieties that are grown are less susceptible to the wilt. They say that they'll survive a little bit better. Once you get this, you want to get this out of the garden because what will happen is the cucumber beetle will get onto this plant and it'll spread the disease to the other plants. So when this starts to happen, there is no cure. It's a clear symptom. You start to see the leaves just wilting like this and it's not a watering issue. It's not a food issue. It's definitely that wilt issue. Uh, so you just want to remove the plants. You can see the beetles if you look, especially in the flowers. You might see a little bit of a striped small bug. It's about a quarter of an inch long. And again, they will spread the disease to all the different plants. That's the problem. Once the plant gets it, you're going to have to remove the plants. If it's early enough in the season, you can plant new cucumber plants. You can even start by seed. But if it's late in the season, unfortunately, you're going to have to just wait until next year. So one thing you can do is spray with Pyganic. That will knock the cucumber beetles right down and kill them immediately. Uh, you can also use Spinosad, which has been reported to help control the cucumber beetles as well. Uh, spray it on the leaves, and when the beetles feed on the leaves, they will tend to die. Uh, but sometimes they can still spread the disease, so you got to play a little bit. You can also use something called Kaolin clay, which will coat the leaves white, and that can help to kind of trick the beetle into not feeding on the leaves. For Growing Wisdom, I'm Dave Epstein.